Well, I think one of the great things we do with legal history here at the law school is have courses specifically on legal history, but also incorporate legal history sometimes into black letter doctrinal courses. So for instance, I teach American legal history from the colonial period up to about Reconstruction. And I teach a survey course that's also a first year elective on that topic. So that's a fun course where we read primary sources and we talk about cases. But I also feel like I can incorporate a lot of that material into constitutional law, federal jurisdiction, by making it an interdisciplinary, having interdisciplinary moments in a doctrinal course, which I think are helpful for understanding the doctrine.